What's up everybody? And today I got some pretty sick controllers to show y'all. Let's get right into this. Now right here we got some we got three controllers, two of them are Xbox One, and three of them are 360. Now right here I done a couple of these controllers. Three are for my close friends and three are for me. And I absolutely love every single one of these controllers. None of these controllers are bad. I think they're all pretty sick. But we're gonna get right into the video. Now, here we go. The first one up is gonna be the blood splatter red one. Let's get right into it. Now, right here, I got this blood splatter type of gory type of controller, man. This controller came out sick. The design came off the top of my head. I got some Modern Warfare 3 snipers, two of my favorites. The MSR, and we got the AS50. I love these two snipers. So I said, you know what, I'll put on this controller because I haven't done one of these controllers in a long time. I've been in a controller, a blood splatter one, in quite a long time. But I was like, you know what, this one, I'm definitely going to do it on. So I said, screw it, let's do it. Sat down, off the top of my head, came up with this design. I think it actually came out really, really good. The bottom of it looks amazing. Gory, I kind of like it. I love this color, this, this red, black, and white, man. I just love that theme. So I, I said, you know what? I can't wait to make another one. Left the buttons, everything black. Everything's black, except for the shell. Got the blood splatters. I think it came out really, really good. Kind of came out the white camera, came out pinkish a little bit, but you know what? It's all good. It's all good. Let's get into the next controller. Um, right here we have this Key Lime Seaside Blue and purple splatter theme controller um, which I use myself I use these controllers all my controllers I use them and the other one I'll show you I'll use got that ooh look at that backspace tiger strike with that key lime bolt splatters I wish you'd say blood splatters but you know they're splatters got some purple splatters in there got some seaside blue splatters got this black trill you got my hand in the background with some sweatpants <laughs> you got yeah, I like it. You got the D-pad, this key lime. Um, I'm going to show you this bottom right here. This bottom, color changing blue to purple. I was like, you know what? Screw it. You got some uh, white triggers. Kept it normal. I was going to do black triggers. But I was like, you know what? I'll just leave them white since I do use this controller. So, you know what? White is, is fine. It's not really. I'm not trying to impress nobody. It's my controller. I'm not worried about it. Even though this controller, I love it. I love the, the colors on it. I think it came out really good. I don't know what my hand is doing. I got throwing them gang signs. Alright, let's get into the next controller. This is the one I made kind of a while back. Uh, this is a color changing green. It color changes to purple. Got all white buttons. The triggers and the bumpers are black, which I'll show you in a second. The backspace right here is color change. It's going to blend in right in with that bottom. Um, I should have got a little closer with the GoPro. I, I, I keep forgetting how this GoPro is such a wide angle, so bear with me. Right here, the color changing. I'll try to get it on the bottom, but it, it's so hard to get the lighting to make it turn purple. But if you see it in person, and you, you do different angles, you'll see that it will go. It will go two different colors. It actually, will go three different colors. There's like I think it goes. Um, I forget what the other color is. It's it's hard to make it do that color. I think it goes like a turquoise type of color. It actually looks fucking sick. Um, right here we got some buttons, all white. All right, there's here it turns purple. I love it, man. I think it. I freaking love this paint the purple comes out really good but yeah let's get into the next controller right here same color color changing uh, green to purple and I made all the buttons purple the start and back I left color changing kind of to blend in with the controller I'm um, trying to make it turn purple you can see it turns purple a little bit see that it will turn right to that purple but you can't really see it because of that shiny shine glossy gloss on it but this controller, he actually uses it. You can see the analog sticks are a little chewed up. I'll get right into that in a second. But look at that purple buttons. Mm, you can't go wrong with purple. Not a lot of people like purple, but you know what? I think it goes really, really good with the controller. It blends in right in real good. The bottom shell, same thing. Color changing. Got the triggers, the bumpers, all that. All purple. The backspace is purple. Everything's purple except for the start and back buttons. I left that. Uh, color change you can see my man uses that controller he uses it um you got that guide button left it stock i think this controller came out pretty good he likes it so hey it's all good now this controller is from my man trigger trigger we made it we got that white 
color changing blue to perp. Um, as you can see, I left the X, Y, A, and B, and the start and back button. I left the stock just because, you know what? I always color the button. I was like, you know what? I'm not going to color the button on this one. I'm going to leave it kind of like a stock kind of controller. Oh, what is that? Is this some tiger stripes? I don't know. I don't know, man. Them tiger stripes. Them tiger stripes real quick. Uh, yep. Oh, baby. This some tiger stripes. Color changing tiger stripes. First time I've done that. Color changing uh, battery pack. The bumpers, triggers, all color change. Um, the D-pad is color change. You can see them bumpers. Mm -mm. Can't go wrong with that color, baby. Cannot go wrong with that color. Alright, so right here we got... I'm showing you the white shell. White came out pretty good. Uh, my white was acting a little funny, but you know what? It still came out pretty good. Asian Promoter did some weird shit too, which I didn't like, but you know what? It's all good. Look at that D-pad. Ooh, look at that color change. Woo! That sparkle on it. Alright, let's get into my next controller. My last controller. This right here is my favorite controller. Look at that. BAM! Controller, Gog. Controller. This thing is absolutely amazing. Seaside blue and perp. Seaside blue and perp. And black. Left the buttons all black. Look at that. Ooh, that seaside blue and that hand. <laughs> but, um, yeah, as you can see, this controller came out 100% awesome. I love it. I love the colors. I love everything about it. This thing is sick. Chica, you ain't getting this controller. This is from my man. Chica, we made it. And, yeah, I know the last two were from him. But, you know what? This controller came out absolutely amazing. He saw it. He pretty much jizzed in his underwear. He has to change it every time he sees his controller. Because I do. I, I see this controller, a little, little bit of that comes out. But, you know what? This controller, that gloss on it came out really, really good. Uh, I actually put a little bit more clear coat on this controller than I did all the other controllers. I don't know why. It just seemed like it, it went with the controller. So, I just put a little bit extra more. A seaside blue perp. Mmm. Man, it's yummy. I want to say thanks for watching the video, y'all. Comment, like, subscribe. Let me know which one's y'all's favorite. It's probably going to be this one because it's my favorite. But yeah. Alright, y'all. I want to say thanks and peace.